I was only curious, dwarf. I meant no offense. I'm merely a seeker of knowledge. The dwarves give nothing away for free. Apologies for the distraction, Master Blacksmith. I'll leave you to your work. Well, what shall I craft for you today, High One? Bottomless breaches for soiling yourself on the battlefield? What were you and the Builder discussing? Harvey, my gentle jailer. You know we dwarves give nothing away for free. If you want your question answered, I'll need something in return. Such as? A hidden fact known only to you, Farseer. That I may share in your secret knowledge of the world. The humans will survive Ragnarok in force, taking shelter in Hutimir's forest, eating morning dew until their race is renewed. The humans are a hearty people indeed, much stronger than we give them credit for. So, you asked what that sack of sheep guts was after? He wanted to know how magic affected your hooger. Why would he want to know the effect of magic on my spirit? Not just you, Harvey. The lot of you. Acid and Vanir alike. I told him to shovel his shit somewhere else. Now, if that's all you came to know, you can piss off and let me work. I have one more need. Can you forge me an unbreakable chain? Chains are overrated. One weak link and it's worthless. Let me craft the cord that Thor himself could not break. It must be strong enough to bind a powerful beast. I will sluice my sweat into this cord, Harvey. All knowledge I have and skill I own will define it. And what will I get in return? My thanks and my hospitality. What more could you need? Ugh. You cannot barter with a man who's squeezing your balls. You may always return to the land of fire, Ivaldi, and die as your brothers did, roasted on a spit. Hmm. To craft such a cord, I'll need a few impossible ingredients. Name them. I the list there. I have a bear's tendon, a fish's breath, and a cat's footsteps, and the root of a mountain. How do I find these? How the fuck would I know? The riddles will guide you. I have no patience for riddles, dwarf. Those riddles are as ancient as the world. With lore passed down from Niji and Nidi to Northri and Sudri, Austri and Vestri, Althjover. I understand. I will return shortly. Valin, Bevor, Babur, Vongbur, Nori, Arn and Anna, I. Babur, Bombur, Nori, Arn and Annar, I, Mjordvitnir, Veig and Ganda. Frein, Deck and Thorin, Thror, Bit and Lit, Nar and Nyra, Regin. Show me.
Go, Sunin. Zunin, guide me. One of Freya's statues. Who put you up here, little cat? So that's how it is. Nowhere to go, but down. I have it. Who knew you could capture a sound? Survey the area, Sunan. Hey, for this me that may go again.
but see you, old friend. Has made the base already. The builder works fast, a bit too fast. to draw attention here. This is the mountain I seek. There's no higher peak. Aid me, be my eyes.
looks like the right place. There is the seed in the mountain's rocky grip. Some heat may free it from its shell. The seed will not sprout root until I get it into some water. Retrieve the root for Valdi before it takes hold. Let's see what you can make of these, Ivaldi. I know a cat's footfall when I hear one. I found everything you asked for. How soon can you finish this unbreakable cord? As soon as it wants to be made. You cannot rush this kind of magic. It flows with a speed all its own. Find me as soon as it's ready. By the way, after we spoke of the Hooger, a cousin came by with his own spirit tale. I don't trust coincidence. So this one's free. What did he say? He told me his sister's husband, Borin, drank a mead brewed in Jotunheim, and it sent his hooger into a goat. The spirit of a dwarf in the body of a goat? <laughs> Stranger still, his sister didn't even notice. Heavy! Don't drag me into this. The tower is nearly finished. Do not fret. The final hours are ticking down. Not fast enough. I feel the jaws of a trap closing upon me. Knowing you are in a trap is the first step to avoiding it. You don't care if I'm married off to this builder, do you? Have no fear, Freya. Whatever things transpire today, you marrying the builder will not be among them. At least have the sense to admit you betrayed my trust. 
I was wrong to use you like that. I will confront the Builder and pry the truth out of him. A limp apology, but it will suffice for now. Once the Builder is dealt with, turn your spear on Loki. Every chance he had, he dug us deeper into this mess. If Loki is up to something, I will see to it that he is punished. Blood Oath be damned. 